Welcome to Welly's World Podcast. I'm your host, Welly Jackson. Three fourths of the crew in the building. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I had no, to, you saw I did the yeah, math real quick. I, know, yeah, I, know, I had to download it. Yo, boom, we're gonna go ladies first. Let's get it in the building. What's How you up? Doing, what's up? What's up? What's up? How is everybody doing? Chilling. Yeah, it doing? is Lex in the building. You know what I'm saying? Real colorful on us today. I feel you. Uh-huh. I'm a little colorful. All right. I don't uh, match really, but it's okay. It's, it's all good. That's, that's what I was getting at. It's all good. That's all right. Uh, my man is in the building after a long hiatus. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> the head of human resources. Yes, I'm back. I'm back. I'm the here. cerebral Jesus I'm is here. in the building, ladies and gentlemen. Nice to be here. Mm-hmm. New threads. I see you. Yes, new. He very yeah. colorful as well. I'm loving this color. Like, I love this color. Thank I you. love this color. And I already know how the material feels, so I know it feels mad nice. I, 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 I'm, I'm trying to purchase something. You that, gave me a great that. one. It was nice. I'm trying to purchase that. Soon. Coming soon. I know y'all got my size. Coming soon. Nah, I'm loving very this soon. color. All this right. Man. Mm-hmm. It's coming. So, Lex, how was your week? It was um, a little up and down, but I got through it. I'm here. I'm good. You know? What's, how was your week? How was the downs? Yeah, what the fuck? Um, what was the up and what was the downs? <laughs> Mad no, big. just a lot. I was a little stressed out, but um, I'm cool now. I'm cool. <laughs> Why y'all staring at you? staring at me. Yeah. I, don't, I don't really care. They want to Nah, know. I'm cool. Really? Shit, fuck all that. <laughs> Shut up. I want to know. She Shut cursed up. me the fuck out. Well, I must have missed that one. I didn't curse. I didn't say the F word, the B word. I ain't that. know Lex was mad curse. at me till I went on Instagram. Wait, what? I missed this. I'm not even mad. Yeah. See, see, I'm not even mad. And if the shoe fits, you wear it. Well, so if I'm not talking about you and you feel like I am, wear the shoe. That's what we here for. Wear, wear what I said on Instagram. Ocean shoes, they fit. She it had it. nothing to do with you. Oh, all right. But that's if the shoe you, fit. That's all you had to say. <laughs> you could wear she it. She put up a meme or something? She, she wrote some... Ooh, should have went with my gut feeling. I right, fuck all that. What, what, how's your gut how, feeling? How does that pertain to you, Welly? Please, <laughs> that's my thing. Like, um. and, and listen, hold up. Shadon already knows. Like I think he knows, or he's well aware of what Ooh. this smile really means right now. <laughs> Like, fuck, you know, fuck all that means. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Go I got ahead. a nigga sitting right over there with the. With the <laughs> <laughs> Where's Spike at? Pew, 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 Where's pew. Spike? <laughs> Shit, man. But anyway, yeah. He, how does that pertain to you? Wait, what happened, though? Get to the. Bro, I, don't I don't even what, know, man. You, you, I don't, you, she mad at you for six weeks straight. You didn't even know. I was not mad at you. When was I mad at you? This was back in the. This was last year. I, I, I was not get mad. shit. Anyway, I'm not mad. I got no beef. You right. know, I could box. I just like to I put that out beef. there. So did you go to gut feeling? I'm machine? learning how to box. Um, yeah, I did, and I feel like too many people have been around me that you know what I thought about a lot was like betrayal. It's like Ooh. crazy, like so crazy how it could really, really fuck you up. <laughs> like it's crazy. Yeah, that shit. Like, um, I mean, like fuck with your mood. I guess. You know, it kind of like makes you refrain from certain people and then it sucks because you can't help them out when they need it because you feel like you isolate yourself. Oh, uh, you sound like somebody with a good heart because you, you know say you I'm can't saying? help people out because, when they need it because like pff, there's so many people like <laughs> I don't wish go, anyone. I don't wish anyone badly, though. I don't wish anyone badly. I wish everyone the best. You I know, just hope they die. Everybody goes to their <laughs> <Pretty> own. <much. laughs> everybody goes to their own battles in life. So I'm like, you know what? It hurts so bad. Like, it's crazy. Like, life is just crazy. That's why I'm writing a book. I think she was hanging around Quote, because he was dropping yeah, poetry right, on her writing, when I was going. I'm writing a book. <laughs> Good thing Quote not here, because he's bringing more poetry. I have so many things to say. <laughs> oh, that's another I thing. That I heard. My he week, was bringing more poetry. My Mother week Sharif. consisted of a lot of poetry, because I had to write and write and write, because I felt and felt and felt, and I was like, oh, God. Okay, like, in so, between my jobs, I'm just like... So, with that being thinking. said... You know? Oh no! <laughs> let's go. Wait, I'm why ready. they do that? I, still I don't know. It's some whack shit they do. But no, no, it's not whack. I think it's more of like it's right, not so, supposed to be so loud. It's supposed to be intimate. And how else can you so cheer? Let's go. Without snapping. Can, can we right, hear on. something? Come on, let's do it. No, you've been not writing right. on I'm this. Phone? Yeah, but you know, I'm not trying to cry and shit. Like I don't want to express what I just had now. But let's come on, move on. Say something. I right, so just spit one of the written let's raps. Move on. Some old shit. Raps. We ain't going no it's all or acapella. No beat. Boom. There you go. Go ahead. No music. <laughs> no. But I got something for you guys later on. Later on. She's going only All right, cool. What's, what's up? Can you cut it out and stop? 
Oh, what I say? Don't she, start with she me. She's not that here shit for already. the bullshit. Right, I know. I'm not quick. here. I already told you before we came up she in said, here. all first quarter, no game. I already I told you before we came myself. up in here. So what about you, Cerebral? How was your, your your week, man? It was good. My month was good. Yeah, you you was like <laughs> fuck them nigga. I thought nigga quit. I'll be honest with you. He stopped texting me back. <laughs> nigga said, "Yo, I'm good." That was it. Like that was it. I was like, nah. he, he he either got somebody pregnant or he oh is me. God. Maybe it's me. So I didn't nah, know. It's never you. Don't say that. It's never you. She mad at me now. I can feel well, it. He can feel she it. She mad every week. At least once a week. I'm not mad. Yo, keep saying I'm mad every week. Then I'm going to really be I mad. I ain't saying at him, though. No. I'm just saying you mad at I'm going to really be week. mad every week if you want to see mad. Ooh. That's, I, when, that's when I just shut up. And that's right. when we just be like, mm-hmm. I, 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 I fucking fire both of y'all up. Boom, boom, boom. Tried to watch y'all go at it. Dude, that didn't work. But anyway, so how, how have you been, man? We ain't, been really, we ain't seen you in a while, man. I know, I know. I apologize, but I've been really, Nobody really... Knows. um. She pregnant? Nah, she's not pregnant. All right, all right, cool, cool, cool. Y'all handled it? We didn't handle it. <laughs> Unhandled. <laughs> She's not pregnant. All right, cool. That would be, be good news, though, if I had a that was, kid. That's what I was saying. Yeah, I would share that right away. You would? Yeah. Then we would never see you. I put up a sonogram on IG and <laughs> oh, all you that. Oh, you that dude? Yeah, I'll do all of that. Oh, yeah. Because, yeah. well, see, yeah. I don't know what type of dude, what, what type of dad I would be. Like, would I be the dad to post mad pictures of my kid? Or just be like, nah, fuck it. If you don't know him, you ain't going <laughs> to see him. I'm kind of leaning towards the But you know the how they do one. all those pregnancy pictures before the bit? You'll see pictures of the me. The 3D like, yeah. sonogram. You'll see, mm-hmm. you know how the woman do all those pictures? And yeah, all, you'll yeah. see me taking pictures alone. Like, oh, you going <laughs> to be on the floor? You going to be the photographer? You going to be on the floor? <laughs> That's dope. They're going to be like, who the baby moms? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> like, this thing reveals by myself. <laughs> I've actually seen people post their children and like blur their face out. Yeah, that's going a little too far. How about you just yeah. don't? How about you, you just, just don't, don't post yeah, the kid? Post. And then they eventually post their child. Like they right. post the kid like, eventually. A lot of celebrities do that. Yeah, I, I, like I get it. You know, it's too soon, but it's like three weeks later, you're gonna <laughs> post his face. Like, just wait. You know what I mean? I get the trimester thing. You know, with like the risk early on in the yeah, pregnancy, yeah, 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 but yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, once you have the baby, like, it's a little, you know. It's You're going to post, right, Lex, when you, when you have a kid? Ooh. Hell yeah. Lex as a mom? I'm going to make <sighs> own Instagram. I'm putting them in my oh, you're going to make like, them their own Instagram? Hell yeah. Wow. I'm trying to make money off them early. No, okay. I want them bills to. in their name, all that. I want them to have, I want them to have something, and then if at Over one point, head, when they're 18, or they make a decision, whenever they make a decision to, like, to flee from it. So you'll never get Cut the shit, Ever. man. She's still going. You know what? I ain't even going to talk no more. Yo, no, speaking of bills and niggas' names, <laughs> I'm good. I just found out somebody got a credit card in my name and they've been paying their bills. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to you. Somebody got a credit card in my name at, uh, I probably shouldn't say the bank, mm-hmm. but they've been paying their shit. My sc- I, you know how I found out, bro? My credit score went up <laughs> a lot. <laughs> Shout out to them. Bro, my shit went up 175 points. So it's at 175 right now. And wow, that's that's that, that that's malicious. Boom. That's Stop. malicious. She's starting her. That's malicious, huh? Mm-hmm. She's coming now. Yo, I'm like, what the fuck? I I, I ain't got no <laughs> account with this bank. And then I'm like, so you know, you look into it. Them motherfuckers been paying their bills for the past six months, man. Shout out to the motherfuckers. What are they at, like Idaho or something? <laughs> Delaware. <laughs> <laughs> One of them places you, when they got time on their hand to do yeah, some shit. Yeah, <laughs> and you know what's fucked up about it? I got family in Delaware. <sighs> <laughs> it's like they not really the people you want taking credit card out in your name. And it's like, how the hell did y'all get my social to do that? I press charges and I snitch. I do all of that. <laughs> like, but they've been paying their shit. I appreciate Shout them. Out to them. <laughs> that was what's up. Yo, fucking what else? Yo, let's get into it. Mm-hmm. You know, you know, since we was talking about Instagram and her kid gonna have her kid, her kid got an Instagram now. <laughs> so you would be mad if you start an Instagram for your kid and niggas don't follow him back? <laughs> <laughs> Like chill. I mean, I'm not gonna go crazy. Like, I'm not. That's not what you know. I'm going. I don't even know like when that's gonna start. It's not gonna be like right away. Could be this weekend. No, but it's not gonna be like. No, I'm talking about like as a newborn. I'm probably not gonna do that. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Like, I don't know how I would go the route, but my kid will probably have one as like. I don't even know about Instagram. Maybe not Instagram. Maybe something else to do like some sort of um. (laughs) 
Look, you know, look, promoting look, look, herself. I don't know. Promoting herself. Nah, 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 nah. nah I didn't, I'm not talking about when she's. But I'm not saying like promoting herself. I meant me handling it. But like, it's more of I want her to be the baby on the clouds on in those commercials that they used to have back in the day. Okay. okay you know what I mean? Like I shit that. like that. Like doing Pampers commercials. Shit. Like you know what? Before a baby, I would have a pet. And I would have a cat and a dog, actually two pets. Oh, so, so cat and a dog, and I would make them Instagrams and be oh, you thought about crazy this. with Ooh. yes. She yes. playing this shit. Out I know I'm gonna dress them up. I know how I'm going to do it. <laughs> Yo, when I when I get my new you know place, cause I'm getting that very soon. All right, so get my money new place. Okay, I'm about to get you know some little pets. They're that so. You, so I she go and test the shit I out on animals. cats and dogs and then just <laughs> be like, fuck yeah. it, I got a kid. Or nah, race I know. Like COVID-19. Nah, <laughs> you before, know what's crazy? I probably will keep my kid off of social media. Come to think of it, you know, I'm, I'm thinking I'm thinking about it now. Yeah, the I pets, too, the too pets creeps. I definitely will invest into, you know, time into social media for. <laughs> too many creeps out there. That's why that's, 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 that shit is just weird to too me. Too many creepy but cat lovers too. My boy, my man John, shout out to my man John, man. He actually manages Terrence Crawford, the boxer. Okay. And uh Vasily Lomachenko, he manages both of them. But his dog, he got a a bulldog. Oh. His dog got like a million and something followers, bro. I'm like, yo, can I get a picture with the dog? Why they like, you gonna post on your shit? Yo, everybody takes pictures with this dog. Snoop, Wiz, everyone you can imagine. That's crazy. I'm like, yo, like his dog got had his face on the side of a uh, like like 18 wheeler type shit i'm like bro like how did like okay you know it, it starts off like That's what lit. she's thinking right like okay. hey you know i'll dress him up so cute this motherfucker <laughs> million followers he makes money i don't know how he makes money off of the dog shit but he do that sounds crazy he told me how much he make but I, I don't know if he wants that public knowledge yeah i'm like wow i wouldn't work <laughs> <laughs> you could probably make money off of youtube if you record videos of them if you teach them how to do certain things like eat no. <laughs> what do bulldogs do? Eat and sleep. Not just a bulldog. Animals. Oh. I want a monkey. That's what's up. I or you could get a spike. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The yeah. dog from Rugrats? Nah, the nigga that produced the show. <laughs> no. Yeah, a spike. Why don't I take a bathroom a spike break? <laughs> dog? He not here. You can talk shit spike all Spike comes with two. You can talk shit. I mean, no, nah, that's my man. Spike. <laughs> I'll be looking at Spike. I'm like, at one. <laughs> my bad shout out to Spike he had an eventful week though I've seen him all over the place where he was at like a, the Yankee game or something like that yeah he oh, took yeah, his girlfriend remember yeah, yeah. yeah. for her birthday remember, oh yeah him. well yeah. if you listen to the podcast no I'm saying I see nah him. he said fuck y'all niggas <laughs> she sounds stuck yo you know what I like about Instagram this shit that be funny to me when you see two people that's that's together now all of a sudden and it's like I know both of y'all y'all don't y'all motherfuckers don't go together that shit is hilarious to me because they don't just be together, post dinner pictures. Nah, they got to let everybody know this shit is real. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? <laughs> they got to let you know, like, nah, found my soulmate. It's like, you motherfuckers knew each other your whole life. He sold drugs and you got a master's degree. How does this <laughs> shit go together? Like, uh, like I, I, I loved, I live for shit like that. Cause it's like, all right, cool. Now, now, I, now that y'all posting, y'all got forty-five to sixty days before y'all hate each other, and you and you taking the witness stand on this nigga. I kind of take that into, um, I kind of relate to relate that to friendships and shit because. Okay. I feel like certain people, like they tell you about somebody. I'm um, saying this, that, and the other, whatever about you, or they tell you. Always you, speaking codes. Go ahead. Go right, ahead, right, right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they say gotta, like, they go it. back and they tell you whatever their friend said, you know, or whatever. Okay, and then, you some know, other shit she posted mm -hmm. on the gram this week. Keep and, going. Yo, yeah, 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 yeah. And <laughs> and this person ends up saying like, nah, you know, fuck, basically on a fuck them type of level, like you know, keep them at a distance and shit like that. And you know, I felt away because um. You know, you're telling me about this person, but then you're going to chill with them and be with them all the time yeah. and shit mm. like that. So I feel like if it bothered you that much, you know, why is it still, you know, so. Now, I see the meme like yeah. that. Like if your friend tells you, yo, don't fuck with somebody that y'all both friends with, are they being loyal? You see what I'm saying? Yeah, it's it's like, OK, so this is where it came from. So um, my best friend, Umi, she posted. Shout out to her. Okay. Shout out to Umi. 
I love you. But um, anyway, so so she posted <laughs> something about like you hear certain shit when you listen to the episode. She's like, yo, let me tell you a story or like, oh, let me ask you, you know, if a friend comes to you and tells you about someone else that's being fake to you and the friendship is fake and all that shit or whatever. Um, you know, is it are they being disloyal? Like, are they not being loyal to you? If you go ahead and, you know, chill with them. I mean, if they well, chill with them. What you think about that? I think that's fake like, as fuck. Like, not even chill, you know? Chilling is fine. It's just like, it kind of, it's it's just crazy to me. I try to fathom the thought. I'm like, wait, but you just told me like this extreme shit. If it's or like extreme, shit that bothered you that you came to me with uh, it. Because yeah. then if that was the case, I didn't need to know anything really. And then maybe you could have just said everything in code and not went into detail what you told me. Because exactly. it's a whole nother, I see a different like impression now or vision of what that person because no one's going to just talk to them by themselves as a conversation yeah so they, like, they had that conversation they had a yeah. conversation, you know and so it's like, crazy to me because another thing is how you you kind of observe how other people are with their friends because then you're like yo the amount of shit that they talk about this person oh you on the list too. i wonder yeah i wonder yeah, like when they're mad I know they get it in about do me. they talk and <laughs> oh, all I'm that, that. Shit. i'm decoding you know it now all right when they mad do well they, you was mad do they go ahead and what? talk? Or I don't know. Is she talking <laughs> about me? <laughs> Yo, she talking about okay, so what about coming back I from... I was not mad. What the fuck? I don't know. Y'all? I missed... I was away a month, you know? Yo, how about coming back from like... You notice how she ain't say no? Mm-hmm. <sighs> you gotta peep that. Damn, man. Bro, I, <laughs> I was not mad. Tra- what are you talking about? My, my train of thought already. <laughs> but anyway, if motherfuckers is talking like that, it's like, when I'm not around, I know y'all talk about me. Uh-huh. So, it, that and that's busy. cool, too. Yeah, it's okay. But... I I I I'm, I I try to be straight up and down. So it's like, well, as soon as I feel the energy is finicky, fuck both of y'all. I'm good. I'm chilling. I it's feel like I'm... there's a certain level sometimes because, like, I mean, if you're going to bash someone, like, literally intentionally bash someone and start questioning mad shit and, like, because it's all your fault, like, whatever you feel is making you feel that way based on, you know, past experience, whatever. You know, insecurities a lot of the time. I just think I, my I, I know my friends. So I know who, like... No one got to tell me about my friends because I know the foul shit they do. Right. I already know. Like, it, it's like I, it's like family. Like, you know if you sleep at that auntie's house, she's going to talk shit. Right, you, you know they got shower. roaches. But that's yeah. different. <laughs> yeah, 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 I mean, that's like, what I'm saying. That's different. Like, now we're ta- like, like, What about someone instance, new? What about someone that is new, like fairly new, like two years maybe? Like, you shouldn't let them be able to. But then do you just drop it, right, at that point? Well, it shouldn't take you two years to get to know somebody. It's, that means uh, you were slipping on your Not family. really. You was messing up on Not really. Because yeah. why they know that much no, information? Because anyway. Motherfuckers get married in six months. It takes two years Oh, Sorry, it. but Kardashian getting married next week. Do y'all feel like y'all know me not that well? Do him. y'all know me that well? Do y'all really feel like y'all know me that well? Well, judging by the way you say it, <laughs> no. Okay, so you really don't know me that well. Just saying, y'all don't know me that well. Oh man, do y'all uh-huh. really know me that well? You think about it. <laughs> it think about it. Is that, <laughs> it. It wasn't even. I don't sound well, like that. Okay, like but that. Yeah, it was, know, don't sound like, like that. But if you think about it, you don't because people have worked with me for like two plus years. I'm not gonna say that they get to know me. Did I open up my whole life to them? No. So they don't really know me. They might know how I move in a way because of our business or whatever. I know you smoke Reggie. Ah, I'm on the wall because she did the you really me. Yeah, she's about, she about to tear you up. I'm out of my business this time. Oh, God. That's all good. Nah, I just think. <laughs> <laughs> she start looking for shit that I don't ain't think, yeah. She know ain't nothing behind that wall. <laughs> to knock the plane over. It's all good, man. That's what's up. Yo, man. I found out. Did you get rid of that friend? Excuse me? Did you get rid of him? You still Get rid of what? That friend. You still, I did that to you. You still fuck with them niggas or no? No, that's the thing. Like, I have love for everybody that has been around me. But, you know, some no, sometimes you got to keep people at a distance. You know, I care a whole lot is the problem. And then I'm going to just keep getting hurt and hurt. And then we never feel that caring and love. Like, with the oldest caring she got, I never feel it. This no. mother lover. He told me to say that, though. By I thought she, I'd be feeling like she ready to swing on it. Yeah. You know I mean? But, yo. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Listen, yo, Jake Paul, he over here, like, everybody's talking about Jake Paul as if he's the new savior to boxing. You know what I mean? Jake Paul's the dude that beat that knocked out Nate Robinson. And he beat up, he knocked out the dude, Ben, whoever. I've never heard of him. But 
you, you, you believe in Jake Paul? You believe the hype? If I'm the business, I got to create a ticket. Right. So it's, I, it's all. It's all. I, I think it's all rigged. I it, think it's all fake. I, I think, think so. it's a. It's a sell. It's a sell. You know. So it's a show. I don't think. I don't believe in them. You know. It's, I, it's, I, I don't I, believe it. I don't believe it. No. It's, it's fake. too publicity. perfect. It's yeah. all. It's all publicity. Like That's he supposed to beat up Nate Robinson. <laughs> Nate, Nate, Nate short. <laughs> he dunk on people. Mm-hmm. I heard he beat this dude. The new dude in like the first round or something. Yeah. 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 But. Yeah, he 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 did. He was a UFC fighter. Listen, I know somebody who could get, who could put paws on him. Who's that? I know I know a hood nigga who could put paws on him. <laughs> <laughs> like who Lex? <laughs> not, oh, oh, oh. Am I a guy? Okay. Hey, right, I see. That's how you get into trouble. Mm-hmm, I know. Yo, <laughs> my man Wax could fuck Jake Paul up straight Ooh. up. My man Wax could fuck Jake Paul up. Yes, I How said it. How much money you got on it? Bro, I ain't got no money on it. <laughs> <laughs> because let's be honest. Like, Jake Paul, is he, he like the box. Wax get busy, though. You see what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So, like, if it's one round, I think Wax going to get it done. I don't think Jake Paul can fuck with Wax at all. Second round, that's where Wax get in trouble. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because I've only seen Wax and Tim's. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he can wear him in the ring. That's but I get, oh, yo, what? If he went, all right, boom. Wax, Jake That's Paul. If Wax could wear Tim's, Wax will fuck Jake Paul up in within the first two rounds. That's I said tough. it. I said it. That's my man. I believe in my man. That's what's up. Yeah. But that third round? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think them Tim's last. Because I've never seen, like, I, <laughs> Like, Wax smoke a lot of weed. Like, I don't know how his lungs can handle that. Like, I know Jake Paul trains seriously. But first two rounds, I confidently could tell you Wax could fuck Jake Paul up, bro. Definitely. Because, cause like, what's Jake Paul next fight going to be? I've seen people, like, really, you know, heavy smokers, like, really play sports and shit and box and shit. Yeah, that's why I said. They're capable. That's why I said the first two rounds. They round. could be <laughs> that third round. Damn, they gotta train a lot, like to get that that <laughs> shit, like really train their wax. Life. Wax, a, a, and that's the Damn, thing. Damn, that's like good stamina. Wax only gonna do push-ups <laughs> <laughs> for his stamina. Bro, let yeah. it happen. Make it happen. Yo, I think we. Uh, yo, let's make it happen. All right. You know what? Because I heard uh, Schultz and Charlemagne talk about it on their podcast, and Wax was into it. I spoke to Wax today, man. I think Wax could fuck Jake Paul up, bro. <laughs> I, I ne- we ain't never seen nobody punch Jay Paul, Jake Paul. Set it up. Make it happen. Wax could fuck that nigga He's up, son. Yo, Wax, I'm calling you after the... Uh, we got to set this Jake Paul shit up, man. I, 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 I'm i with it. I got to see this shit. I got to see this. Why? Just because... Why? I, I don't, of them. It's the hype. I don't like the <laughs> hype, bro. <laughs> I don't like all that. They're talking hype. about him fighting. I don't like a lot of things. Fighting Mayweather. They trying to hype that up. I would never watch that shit. Jake Paul versus Floyd Mayweather. That's what I'm hearing. Cause I like it, look, look at what it is. Like they hyping Jake Paul up to be this knockout specialist, and it's obvious he's not. Yeah. Like it's obvious, but it looks different. Okay. I, like I do TV. I know what this supposed to look like. <laughs> you know what I mean? And I know this is some TV shit, but. <laughs> Like the best part about the Jake Paul fights, Snoop is the commentator, <laughs> bro. <laughs> I seen the clip online because you know niggas don't really watch the fight. We watch the Instagram, mm-hmm. bro. So <laughs> yeah, the highlights. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. So <laughs> the ref was like, "All right, yo, yeah, break." <laughs> Snoop was like, "You gotta make him break, motherfucker." <laughs> <laughs> now I'm, I'll pay to watch that. Yo, that's the funny thing. <laughs> I'm used to Jim Lampley in the background. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, oh, this is a slug fest here. <laughs> Nigga, you gotta make him break. Get the fuck you mean? Snoop Sheesh. man, funny. But I think Wax I like I, I the Jake Paul and Mayweather, uh I've seen Mayweather fight Pacquiao. Like, it's not really exciting yeah. boxing. Mm-mm. I love what if I was a boxer, I would do what Floyd does. I don't yeah. want nobody hitting me, yeah, so exactly. boom. He's gonna last a lot of years. Yeah, but you know, uh I definitely want to see because Wax going sw- like you know I-, I feel like these people who be fighting Jake Paul they scared to hit him because they scared to get hit. What's Wax background though? He's like security or something, right? 
Well, he, he do security for Charlemagne. Oh, okay. And he got the Who's Wax shit. The Who's Wax, the, the Supreme <laughs> Cannabis. Boom, bless Lex with it. Uh huh. Look how blushing this. Uh huh. She wanted some more. She wants oh, some she more. Has some? How it was, was yeah, yeah, I got you. Nah, I dropped the pack off. It was good, and I'm not going to front. I still have because I think it was the eighth, but I still have. She's snitching on herself. Go ahead. Uh huh. What? No, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. What I snitch about now? No, uh, he's he just fucking with you. Yeah. He ain't been here in a while. He don't know what he's saying. Mm. No idea. So then don't speak if you don't know what you're saying. Okay. Oh. You tell what she was thinking all that. All right. Mm -hmm. Nah, but I'm just saying. Um, yeah, no, it was good. It was a good. It, it, it was, was chilling. Good. It wasn't nothing crazy. Honestly, I was. It helped me sleep. Yes. I don't want to say it put me out, but I was getting the itis <laughs> already, but it did help me sleep without, you know. Bro, I got to get you some of the lemonade. I gave you the lemonade. No, it was here and you were dangling it, but you didn't even give nobody nothing. Yo, but I'm, I did. Copy have honest with y'all. Can I be honest with you? I'm, I, I believe in transparency. I had right? some recently. You, the Who's Wax Lemonade? No. Oh, I'm about to say, whoa. But right. that's why I want to try it. I want to see the difference. He gave me lemonade for all you motherfuckers. <laughs> and he probably drank that <laughs> shit. I was that's, that's why he was out for I like was in four days. <laughs> I got Bro. thirsty. He was non existent for like four days or whatever. That shit, yeah, trip. I thought about you. Um, <laughs> what happened was <laughs> he gave me a bunch of them. Bro, that shit was in my refrigerator. I was having a hard time going to sleep one night. I knew I know what the lemonade do. Boom, well, knock that shit out. I slept great for a week, nigga. Oh man. Uh, but I'm gonna get y'all more. I'm gonna get y'all more. The Who's Wax Lemonade. I'm gonna Is get it. Is it in that little bottle? Yeah. The little the little uh, the little lemon joint. So do you know do you remember how much is in I ain't no scientist. Fuck out of here. This shit made me go to sleep. I felt good. I'm just Lex saying, because I Einstein. had a drip of something recently. You and had a drip? It, a drip of like, like a drop, a drip. What, a drop, drip a drop. drop, yeah. Like you driving like, the boat? Through the vial, no. Through the wow. vial, whoa, this is a whole other no, drug. No, the no, it's it's like, a, it was a drink with THC in it, but it was in like a little a little bottle too with a little dropper. Like, you know, the dropper. Oh, with the dropper, yeah. okay. Yeah, that's how you, rep that's how you know Because you got to squeeze the time. Yeah. So I did that and my whole tongue like went numb and then oh, I was, was smacked after oh. that. So you were just out here on some. Honestly, I think I had Henny in it too. My bad. So the Henny make your oh. tongue numb? Yeah. Yo, I still got that yeah, yeah. that shit. Remember we? <laughs> nope, I don't Maybe it just burned. I Maybe. don't remember I still anything. Got that shit in the car, bro. <laughs> what the lemon it thing? It definitely or burned in the package. <laughs> oh, bro, yeah, it's some whole other shit. It's 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 uh it's uh it's it's alcohol with THC in it. Yeah, I would, and you didn't want to give that's it. That's not me. what wax shit got. Wax has lemonade with THC. With THC. No, no, no. I know that. There's some other shit. I just remember. Yeah, I remember that night. That's why I was like, nah, I remember. I was so drunk off like three sips, and then I had to drink with the THC. That shit's still in my car. I'm scared to touch it, bro. We didn't even know what was going on that. It's I didn't have none car. of that one, neither. No, I mean, That's some of the other stuff. Yeah, I ain't touch it. I'm scared. <laughs> that shit might have me naked on the highway doing the podcast <laughs> with myself. <laughs> with all the microphones on the shit. <laughs> that shit is going to go bad. Some Indian in the car. style. <laughs> Liquor go bad. No, but it's mixed with something. It's the heat. Ew, that's going to take... Ain't, it ain't hot outside. It's New York It's going to get there. You said you don't know how long it's been in the car for. I know how long it's been in the car. So you were lying. <laughs> the car's our refrigerator. You know that. Yeah, it's a refrigerator. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, with no cooler? Nah, she make it seem like we weird. Mm -hmm. We just leave shit in the car. You are weird. We weird. Mm -hmm. It ain't like I left a baby in the motherfucker. You ever seen inside her car? I don't know that. Nah, I never seen inside her car. Grocery store. Grocery store? Mm -hmm. Oh, <laughs> Go shopping in there. The bodega. <laughs> <laughs> I used to go to the bodega down the Oh, he said he point. said your car is like a bodega. That means it got a cat in there. <laughs> so funny. Ah, she hates me. So funny. It's all good. good. But nah, I'm not fucking with Jake Paul. I'm not jacking it, man. I think wax could fuck him up easy. We I'm know. With I'm with it. Make it happen. I I, I wouldn't even see I, I wouldn't really worry about Floyd and him because that's yeah. He's not gonna be able to hit Floyd. <laughs> and Floyd's yeah, not gonna yeah. knock him out. Floyd's not trying to knock nobody out. You who, see what I'm saying? Who he fought? Floyd fought what's the name, right? I forgot his name. Who? Uh the last fight that was his last Floyd's last fight? Oh, Conor McGregor. Conor McGregor, yeah. Yo, uh, my man put that fight together, bro. Yeah. Adam Glenn, TMZ paparazzi. He seen Floyd in New York and mentioned it. I think he might have seen Floyd in Vegas. Mentioned it, hyped it. Floyd gave a, a he obviously he responded on camera. Connor 
I'm definitely telling the story backwards. <laughs> but he instigated the shit. Boom, the shit really happened, bro. Like, <laughs> Floyd told him that's why it happened. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, no, that's my man, Adam Glenn. Shout out to Adam. That's my man. But, um, yo, moving on. Quo's not here. Can we get questions with Lex this week where the fans right. get to questions ask us questions? With Lex. All right. Woo. All right, well. You got to give us a minute because uh, she said her phone. She now my phone locks. I have it on a 30 second lock. So oh, I we know. Like going every time it's someone. We home, know. You know what I'm saying? Enough. We all know her it's code. So, yeah, what's my code? The triangle shit, Rock Nation, bitch. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> she got the same song. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, it's not. But anyway, let's, let's go. Start questions this. with Lex. Um, from Rolando. All right, shout out to him. Shout out to Rolando. Rolando. Would you forgive a girl or a guy if they cheated on you one time? Yes, but don't trust me after. <laughs> that sounds accurate. <laughs> like, I, right, I forgive you. We can move on. For all the fuck, all that. What did y'all do? Okay, so you want to know what they did? You so it know? depends. Yeah, so it depends. Uh, I gotta know, son. That's rough. So it depends on that's certain rough. things. You, did you? I, I'm the nigga. You wanna know? Oh, I'm the nigga. Yeah. Yo, I don't know if on, I can on do the that. Fab album, where he said, "You suck. You gave him head. <laughs> <laughs> you gave that. You suck that." So head. it matters. So certain things matter. Yes. So what if it was just but a you kiss? You want to know? I, I need to know, bro. Damn, you would want to know. Because if it's just a kiss, that's different. Okay, but but they lying though. If it's like, they ain't believing that. Yeah, you wouldn't even tell me if it was a kiss. Fuck out of here. <laughs> Have you ever been in a position where maybe you cheated one time and you were Black like, "I'm never gonna cheat. cheat again"? Black men don't cheat. Well, uh, that's true. Black men do not cheat. But hypothetically, hypothetically speaking, back when I was a black boy, mm -hmm. um, that's funny. <laughs> have I ever been in a situation? <laughs> yeah, I was just like, I, you give, bro. I think every guy does that w w when they cheat. They He's give. Speaking it. for himself, in the in the, the views expressed by Welly Jackson is not the views of the Welly World podcast. There we right? go. We right, haven't had ahead. that in a while. Okay, go ahead. So, in in the event that a, a guy cheats, especially a black man. Or black boy, you gotta give your life to God after. Listen, God, if you could just get me through this, and I mean, get me completely through this, <laughs> Lord. I'll never do it again. I will never <laughs> do this shit again. I will rest on Sundays, Lord. I said, I will rest the dick on Sundays, Lord. <laughs> if you could get me through this. <laughs> anyway, you ever cheated? I'm she cheating cool. now. Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> no. First of all, you know, like when I was younger, we did the whole me. back and oh, forth, the me. whole back and forth shit. When I was a girl, mm -hmm. what we but never said. You know what it is? It all started with that guy cheating on me first. So you know what I mean. Always blame that. But we were nah. But I was young. I was very young minded. Now I move a little differently. It's like there's so many there's so many factors. So that, just like what Willie said, it depends. What is cheating? That's what I'm saying. It depends. It depends on what you consider cheating is. Now, or back some then? people are like, <laughs> oh, good question. Now, now, now. I mean, like, what about now. just when having? A, in, what about virtual <laughs> conversations? When you invested, a hug could be cheating. <laughs> when you invest any time, what about time? Like, time is like you invest in time, but what if it's just conversation and you just think she's cheating because she's talking to another dude? When you're dreaming about the next, it's cheating. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, like in that was in Why Did I Get Married too, but anyway, um, they yeah, because she was that? yeah, T O O T O O. Why did I? Oh, get all right, all right, yeah, yeah, you right. Yeah, and um, yeah. I think cheating once you invest it, any emotional, any emotional connection, bro. Yeah. Texting out, te texting past a certain time, that could be cheating. Yeah, you know I mean, you got a pet name for the nigga word. Pet names, it's so stupid, yo. When when they when you go through their phone book and they have like. N. <laughs> they got in. S. She go through the phone, y'all. Shit like R. that is what I'm got like, me what out the, the street. I'm like, what? I'm not going to play Ro. that game. Who nah. is Ro and who is Bo? Nah. Who the fuck are these people? I Ro, like, Ro, 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 your boat. I swear. <laughs> Ro was in there, too. Who the fuck is Pizza Hut? <laughs> There's no Pizza Hut in the whole Wait, city that I, we live in. But I save Domino's in my phone. I get hungry. And why is it a 917 number? That's a cell phone. That sound like a nigga with good dick. That, that sound like it sound like I be having my name under that. Yeah, yeah. No, they didn't have a landline at the at the you know because they want the service. You know, what? they had to keep the cell phone there. Well, um, honestly, I feel like to each their own, and it depends on you know what everyone's so, boundaries are. What's so, cheating to you though? Yeah, what's cheating? Um, if you had a bay, what's cheating? And is it different from boys and girls? Yeah, you gotta get their perspective. I think the views are a little different. Like if you was with a guy, is different is cheating different from him? 
than when you're with a girl? Or is it the same? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, every like I said, everybody's different. But with me, I would say anything, anything. Kissing is, it's cheating, yeah, but there's a certain level of, I guess, that that you would accept. So and probably say, oh, they didn't do shit. Like, people say, listen, when you have sex, that's cheating. Because you went all out. People they say had that? all of you. Yeah. <laughs> they just people yeah, say that. Yeah, yeah. But <laughs> oral anything, any sex. We're talking about yeah. orally anything. If you if bro, if <laughs> <laughs> Lord, take me out of here now. I please. swear like this is literally so, how high school was. Like this is what the mentality of high school boys were. Like this is what I heard in high school. Like shit is so stupid. Yo, if your shorty have sex with another dude. She can't, bro. That's it, Lord. It's over. That's yeah. cheating. Uh, not even Take just me. cheated, though. I don't think a that's man, a whole nother level. I don't level. think a man can come back from that. That's what I'm saying. So he could be in the same There's... vicinity, but his soul is crushed. Like you, you could probably make it work for another thirty days. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so but <laughs> doesn't it? Maybe it depends on you know how long you've been with them for. You know, that, I no, guess, bro. And, um, men out. We, like we're I not said, that strong uh, women. Look, yeah, y'all give birth. It's different. Women, a woman will never break up with a man for cheating on him, ever. But men, the thought of you cheating, you we're are, done. You are not speaking for women right I'm, now. Yeah, no, you he, are bro, not speaking every for real, women right now. every real one knows this. Mm -hmm. What? Hey, he, I think they care more women about looking don't, stupid than the That's cheating. it. There's exes I didn't take back. The fuck? Bro, it's not that. It's this is what it is. You cheat on a girl. She's like, oh, fuck, whatever, whatever. Now she got to belittle you. <laughs> then you ain't shit. Blah, 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 blah. Ew, that's the type of bitches you <laughs> fuck with. All that, right? <laughs> Not every female is like that. And then <laughs> she looks at you like, like, like a peasant. <laughs> then she leaves. It's never, hey, I cheated, I'm out. She gonna be like, whoa! whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Not with that dick, you ain't leaving. No, 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 no. Rolando. They gotta, they gotta belittle you. Yeah, yeah. ew, you wear pink. Mm, you must have been fucking every, a nigga. Every, I'm, every situation oh, is so different. Extra shit. Actually, it wasn't a nigga. It was your sister, motherfucker. <laughs> every situation is different. <sighs> okay, so don't listen to what Welly's saying <laughs> at all. So if your man cheated on you, you could forgive him? No, I'm not saying that. It, no, I'm not, I didn't say you said it that. It depends on what it is. I mean, I've forgiven people before. No, I'm talking about now, today. If your man cheated on you, he had sex with another female. Mm, I don't know. I can't, I can't just all, say that. I can't put myself in that position again without being in that position again. Did all the positions with her that he do with I'm going to say that I'm not... That's probably why I avoid certain shit. Like, I don't want to have to worry about any of that shit. I got other shit to worry about, which is why I'm probably steering clear. But, yeah, I mean, I don't know. It's a, I don't know. I don't want to believe that I would. I really want to stand up for, like, you know, I'm very independent. I try to not have to need a man. There's people out there that feel like they need I ain't going to front. And, like, we've all been suckers and tried to make this shit work, though, at least. Yeah, but that's life. that's when you love someone. I get all that, you know, because when you're young, like, people say, oh, have, like, you know, a lot of the elderly people that I'm around, they're like, yo, just have fun. They be talking about how they had 10 boyfriends and, or whatever, and oh, they live their life. Yeah, so, you, got, you got bad advice. That's why they that's didn't nurse They look, they, that's why nah, there's people, and they were mad, and they, nah, they've been married for, like, 47 years years too was like crazy yeah. it's crazy because they went through it and honestly like sometimes you got to find that person like to have fun with together if y'all about that Yo, life you know what yeah, 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 yeah. I, I seen you was ready to rock out now just i'm wondering like is the world going to change where multiple partners is going to become acceptable i wonder that kind of like it kind of like know. as long as i don't know it don't hurt me but it just Cause it ain't happening in our era. I just no, to, uh, I ain't going for that shit. I fucked up <laughs> Bro, with a girl. That's too many. Like, think about it. If I got two girls at the same time, boom, 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 that's dinner twice. <laughs> Doing it for three motherfuckers. That's how I I'm saw good. it. I, I was hooking up with a girl when I was with a guy, and I felt like you know one that was just fun, but the relationship was that, and I feel like they Did probably didn't feel a way. Um, yeah, to an extent. Um, yeah, but. 
I That's feel like oh shit. I seen a porno like that one time. <laughs> Brazilian party. Nah, but oh, see, Brazilian joint. <laughs> but none of that was gonna happen between all three of us. None of that was gonna happen. Why because, not? Because they weren't about that life. The what? girl. Oh, the oh. shorty was it? Yeah, she wasn't about that. What she 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 she, she, dressed, she dressed like him, or she was a girly girl. Mm-hmm. Like she was like if you got a girl nah, who's dressed right. like wax, you might as well just go get a nigga, bro. No, because it's not about that, and we're not looking at how they dress, even though sometimes. They, they be attractive. Fly. Yeah, yo, uh-huh. I found this baddie on they Instagram. Stay with the clean too. She braids hair. I was like, yo, oh my world, god. As I get older, females confuse me more and more. More and more. I don't understand. I, I can't understand. I, I, I give up. Why would you get a uh, whatever? That's yeah. Why would you get a what? Because they look. Because they confused. dress like you just a get man. A dude rather than get a girl that look like a dude. That don't make but sense. But it's not about that. Why you're you thinking dude, physical? I'm just saying we're if you're not on that side, about that. You know, you're like, all right. I'm with this person, that's my person, but to just... Like, honestly, what attracted me to her wasn't even the way she dressed, but then I did, like, not like the way she dressed. I didn't. I actually but she was like, like, ooh, this shit Because like out of the uniform, it was, like, a different, a different, like, a whole she different that, style, yeah, like, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So, I mean, I didn't personally like it, she but it wasn't non- about that. She put that I wasn't going to try to, <laughs> try to change non-inch. the way she dressed or anything like that. Yo, if you get caught cheating... <clears throat> damn, that's going to fuck up. If you get caught cheating, bro... I know how you can get your girl back. So. If you cheat on her and she leave you, that's what I'm saying? She's not going to leave you for that. But nah, you know, they, don't, they, they make like the not. threat. They yeah, make yeah, the yeah. threat. Bro, you want to know how you get your girl back? Let me hear this shit. Just tell her you're going to kill yourself, bro. <laughs> 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 just tell her you're gonna kill yourself, bro. Nobody. That does was. not always work. You end up in it a worked, psych ward no, before you well. end up jacket, with them, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you fuck this. I'm out of here. <laughs> and then, hang up and then when she does do that, God forbid. No, you, no, gotta, you gotta say it. She can't do she it. She can't do it because she probably you, really do it. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Girls always stick to their shit. I'm telling bro, I'm just telling y'all what I know. What I if she know. says she's going to kill herself? I and then now that. we got to have a talk intervention, mm-hmm. all of that. What if there's no home. talk intervention? Nah, when women make threats, like, women are smarter than men. When they mm-hmm. make threats like that, I listen. Yeah. But I just You don't, don't laugh? Well, well uh, I, I'm but, a fucked up nigga. I yeah. laugh. I have nervous laughter. So when people, <laughs> when I see people getting serious, I laugh. That's just my thing. But I don't mean it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like people have told me, yo... My mom's just had a stroke. <laughs> like, I'm fucked up. I know I'm fucked up, but I'm, yeah. I'm dealing with that internally. You know what I mean? I'm dealing with that internally. <laughs> but what's the next question? Let's keep going. So you know you're fucked up, so that's intentional. No, it's not intentional. I can't control it, but I know so what it looks like. So then why would it be fucked up if it's something you can't control? Because I know what it looks like. It's, I, you mean it seems fucked up, but it's not fucked up. I'd rather, I'd rather just beat them to it. Like, instead of saying, instead of somebody hearing, oh, well, you're fucked up, nigga. I'm going to tell you. I'm going to disarm you. I'm a fucked up, nigga. That's my thing. That's how I do. Next question. Anyway, shout out to Dana. All right, shout out to her. Um, how long should you wait until you introduce someone you're dating to your kids? Ooh, ooh. Women are smarter than men. What about you think? What you think? I ain't got no kid. I don't know. I mean, to be honest, I would be so because of my past experiences, I would be afraid to even introduce someone new to my children. So it would take for me personally a very long time. I can't say how long, but I mean, if it becomes serious and you feel like you fell in love and, you know, they met the family, maybe bring them around your kids too as a friend. What if he DM your kid on Instagram? What the fuck? Because you're going to have the Instagram popping. <laughs> Bruh, I'm blocking them. <laughs> All right, just ask him. Like, That's hey, simple. Uh, I have yeah, like I've been knocking moms like... off for six months now. I think it's time. <laughs> I finally want to meet 20. you. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> I heard I mean, you I... like Pokemon and shit. I <laughs> love Pokemon. But um, <laughs> that's a tricky question because it depends on how many other dudes the kids done met. Like yeah. if, if they meeting dudes, if this shit is like a train to an airport, it's like I bro. If this, how, how do the kids know this is the one? That's a good question. So that question you should ask. Like if, right before you, when you start feeling like you're getting closer to that point, you should ask yourself. Yeah, that. like well, 
the crazy part when you meet them and you the side dude and they see you in the street and they ain't supposed to know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're like, what up? <laughs> yeah, I mean, I see that shit on TV. Uncle <laughs> Tommy. <laughs> <time. laughs> Not or somebody just or a dad or your dad comes right out the car, like fixing himself and shit, like fixing his pants, coming out the car and and his daughter's right there down the block at the corner. Oh my god, that shit crazy. No, nah, that's a um I would say that's just crazy. I don't think you could really put a time limit yeah. on it. But if you serious, it's all in the presentation, though. Don't just have them pop up at the crib. Have them go, go out to eat or something. I mean, they're something. asking about how long. So I feel like it's it's an individual thing, though, too. Yeah, you can't really put no time. Because on you have to feel secure that. I mean, I probably I don't know. I would say after three good arguments, boom, he's locked in. <laughs> he's locked in. He knows you crazy. He none seen you do all of that shit. The neck, boop, boop, boop. Debbie, you fuck with them bitches. <laughs> Boom, three of those. I don't know who he's mimicking. Nobody, I'm just saying in general. I know. What about you? When do you think is a good time? I don't know because like everyone that you that I'm around, I'm around for a little bit. So it's like I'm already around them before it's even something. You yeah, know? Kid, kids. Like, I don't meet new, pe new people. Like I don't. Honestly, I mean, we don't have kids. Yeah. I don't. So we're we're kids. answering from, you know, a perspective, like a non-parental yeah, yeah. perspective. Kids remember everything, so you got to be careful. <laughs> yeah. But I definitely remember. Sure. Yeah, I think it's all in the presentation. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? It but, is. But got next question. I guess you um, work rock cable. Cable. <laughs> <laughs> cable. We up there. Yeah. So why Shout you lock the room door? Shout out to Rocco. <laughs> Shout out to Rocco. What up, How man? do you Rocco, get Rocco. out? How do you get out the friend zone with someone who put you there years ago? But boom, boom, perfect. First off, I got this. I got it. You don't got this. This is how you do it. First off, you fucked up because you waited years. You may not even still be in there, but this is what you do. You you got to reestablish the connection first of all. Boom. If she's then it because you only could the friend zone has like a time limit on it. Like if she put you in a friend zone ten years ago, you could just send a dick pic. Boom, you out. <laughs> Fuck it. She like boom. The rainy Tuesday night. You win there, but you reestablish the friendship, right? Just to connect. You know what I mean, boom, boom, boom. She friends on me. It depends on how long ago it was. She friends on you. How long he said it was? Years ago. Years ago. All right, cool. That's too long. Because <laughs> women update their friend zone every three to four months. All you got to do, as soon as she puts you in the friend zone, start an argument. Fight with her. Fight with her. Fight with her. Fight with her. Then it fucks up the algorithm, bro. <laughs> it fucks up the algorithm. Now you be a sweetheart. Hey, I'm sorry. Da, da, da. Can I take you out to eat? Yeah, come on. Let's go out to eat. You out the friend zone, y'all. That's a date, motherfucker. The <laughs> fucking date. I do. I told Quote this shit. Quote called me one day. Yo, that shit works. <laughs> uh, I'm like, huh. I know, but I'm out the game. I know it works. I don't use that no more. What, it's yours. What do you think? Personally, you sometimes. On dude. Personally, I think sometimes friends make the best couples in I'm some just, situations. I was say lovers. All right, go ahead. Lovers too, whatever. Fuckers but and friends? Then, yeah. I that seen does work. The other day. Well, that works Mike, very well if y'all on the same page. I don't remember. <laughs> no. What now? So I think I got that one. Like, this shit. <laughs> what is it? What is it? I can't find this shit. This shit is funny, bro. Funny. What do you mean you don't know, but it's funny? You uh, gotta know. I don't know. <laughs> All right, look. This is the beam I think he talking about. <laughs> Nigga said <laughs> It's a text right He said yo The neighbor's kids Just challenged oh, us I, To a water fight Oh I didn't see that one Right <laughs> So my man said I'm in I'm just waiting For the water to boil <laughs> <laughs> And then You know you swipe it His Jordan face He said fuck them kids <laughs> <laughs> nah, I talk about That was the way You talking about <laughs> I, I love that it. shit So when Jordan Say it. fuck them kids bro Sheesh. Cause I know Jordan Meant that shit Really That's Jordan I like it. Anyway, <laughs> what are we talking about? Getting out of the friend zone is a little bit difficult because okay. um, you know, sometimes you don't want to ruin a friendship. You're like, you know what comes with a relationship, so it's kind of hard to get Why well, got to be a relationship? Yeah. I can't They're trying to get out the friend zone. What are they what else are they trying to do? Deep. Be in uh, no relationship and they trying to get out the friend zone. They trying to be in a relationship. I know Rocco. Rocco trying to beat. Hey, Rocco just trying to Rocco honestly 
I would just have a, oh, damn. It kind of sucks because the people that have spoken to me and poured their feelings out and stuff, I kind of, like, really couldn't stay friends with them after that a little bit because it was just kind of too much. Oh, so dudes pour their heart out to you and you just cut them off completely? It's not cutting off completely. I don't think y'all like that, though. No, like it's that? not that. It's not that. It's like if they already know where I stand with everything, you know, if you're going to say it, like, really say it a second time, like, really, like, really, really say it a second time, um, I feel like, you know... I told you already how I feel and how can I, I might feel uncomfortable around you. But that's how I felt, you know, growing up. But what if it's weighing on his heart and you just posted the right thing at the right time and he's like, I got to tell her, I got to, she got to know. Da, 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 now, da. I mean, listen, like, that's what I said. We have a discussion and then if it becomes too much after that and I start to feel uncomfortable, then it got to go, you know, a different way. And we can be acquaintances. Like, I don't want to, like, say I hate anybody. Or anything like that just for that. Because they can't. Sometimes you just can't help how you feel. I guess. I'm telling you. It's the Let's friendship the that. Well. It's the friendships that. The relationships that lead. Um, you to. To be able to be in a relationship with somebody. But the friend zone's hard to get out of. I don't even know if I could give you a clear answer <laughs> to that. <laughs> They're not paying attention. But. No we got. We got a good, good meme going on over here. Tiana Trump. Shout out to her. I like. I shout out to Legends. She said, uh, I'll give you head as a friend. If you need head, just say you need head. <laughs> Got the Jordan shit, nigga, Jordan. <laughs> yeah, that's a friend zone. I don't People say that all the time. Like, yo, I could just be your, you could just. That's what niggas are saying in the end? Yeah. Yeah, they just want, like, they're like, can I be your toilet? What? Can I be what? your, can I be your uh, seat or something or whatever? Yeah. Yo, we got a new segment on the show. In DMs Lex. with Lex? Yeah, yeah. Ah, you named it. Because I, I, what you said? Green, 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 the man. Uh, you name it. I should. I <laughs> Top should five DMs this week with Lex. Boom. What so what they be saying? Again? What's that number five? Go ahead. I wanted to do that. I have an Instagram. My mother said I'll be your toilet. Shout out to him. What's his name? Go ahead. Nah, I can't say all that. They might have a girlfriend or a wife or something. Who knows? You're definitely a wife. But bored as hell. What else people saying in your DMs? Damn, I shouldn't have said that shit. That's no, that's good. This, this is good. Is good content. Yeah, uh -huh. nah, it's just um, a lot of things, man. They like say what? a lot of things. You know, like they, they want to smell my feet. <laughs> what? The you know, honestly, fuck? as a kid, but I'm not gonna lie. Wearing, like, there was sneakers? a little kid that I used to get babysat with. <laughs> nah, there was a kid I used to <laughs> smell like three on threes, bro. Listen, there was a baby, a, a <laughs> kid that I used to get babysat with. I mean, I was like, oh, I was like, oh, Bruh, there was a kid that used to say your sneakers smell like 21. <laughs> Maybe when I play ball. Oh, I forgot she knows. She's a play <laughs> she ball. That shit. Maybe yeah. when nigga I play ball. That's why I had to get those slides to air on my feet. Everybody's nigga walking said, out with them fucking basketball nigga, shoes nigga, or their other shoes or their Uggs. I'm like, ew. Nigga say your kicks smell like. <laughs> your kicks. My, you want to smell it right now? Nigga say your kicks smell like two. You want to smell it right now? <laughs> nah, I'm, I'm telling you what nigga said. I don't know them. Yeah, nigga, nigga, I didn't say it. No, nigga. You pointed at him. No, no, no. Nigga said that. Niggas is never the person I like. No, but anyway, this kid that I used to get babysat with, he um he used to want to smell my feet. <laughs> yeah, it's like I don't even so know. He was what young the though, fuck. right? Yeah. What else young shit, probably? Babies. Why not? I never wanted to smell anyone's feet. No, we're talking young, young like ten. What else they 11? saying in the DM though? Know. Yeah, number at number yeah, three. Like what else they feet? Yeah, number three. Number so three. We got we got, we got, we got two five now. and four. Go ahead. Four. Three more. Go ahead. I don't know three. what y'all talking about. Oh, you don't know? Top five DMs um, with Lex for the week. I don't know, man. I got to go through my DMs for that. I can't think right now. That's, you have your phone in your mm -hmm. hand. Fuck the rest of the questions. These are real <laughs> questions now. Because they asking. They was in the nah, comments nobody last was week. Like, I wonder what was in her DMs. There's a lot of things in my DMs. Let's go. Uh -huh. Could we visit there? I mean, they'd be wanting like to see me. <laughs> you know what I think we should do, bro? What should we do? <laughs> in her DMs, have you read them? Cause she's gonna give us what she wants us Good. to know. Yeah. He's a nice, unbiased person. He is Good, not about to guy. go through my DMs. Why? Why not? Because I said no. I'm gonna put in a group. Cause you reply. You Sometimes I do reply. Sometimes I do. What? So for most, you know, it's all about. Be like, I just. Because it'd be you. funny. Sometimes I'm like, LOL. What the fuck? And a lot of people like to get humiliated. They want you to say you have How a small penis. How much would you charge penis. a nigga to smell your feet? What? I'm not. Nobody's smelling my damn feet. What if they got that bag though? It has to be like at least five hundred plus dollars. They can smell my feet for like two minutes and then get the fuck out. <laughs> for two minutes? 
What nah. are you trying to smell? What, so what celebrities tried to smell your feet? Nah, I mean, listen, I don't know. Celebrities but honest, honestly, celebrities I would probably do that shit if somebody want to smell my feet. Right, let's take it back to, the, to Biggie shit. He said the bitch wanted me to lean over cock and shit on her stomach. <laughs> a nigga said that in your DMs. I want to throw up. How much would you charge a nigga to do that in a DM? I don't. What? That is not happening, period. He said, period. I will feed you a limited Hell. white castle. <laughs> you go at the shit, bro. You go at the shit. I'm sick. It's really yeah, different. No. I'm no, but a lot of it. I got that from Biggie. I didn't make that up. A lot of the DMs. Y'all heard, you heard this song before. They be you humiliating it. stuff. It like right. like I said before, Like they want, they're like, oh, um, can you... Tire, get someone to tie me to a tree or something and like be in a bikini or like have they want me to watch them be tied to a tree and humiliate and laugh at by girls. What do type that, of sick white shit is this? It's not, I mean, do listen, that, that next I'm not against that any of it, you she know, did, whatever they like week. is what they like. She you know, paid. whatever they like is I don't judge because I don't care. I mean, it be weird. it's weird to me, but I don't I don't care. Like I don't care. Whatever they do is what they do. Or wanna what do they want, whatever they like. But what if they wanted to tie you up? Nobody's tying me up, but I could get out of a, a rope. You did it before. Yeah, I have a rope. <laughs> oh, she tied up that before. type of shit. She in that yeah, but I also I did a shoot with the rope. <clears throat> she into that type of shit with the black lipstick and all that type of shit. Damn right I am. I like that shit. Why are you like to be spanked and shit? <clears throat> My I don't like that. My people come from slaves. I like the dominatrix <clears throat> and I want to laugh, but I'm shit. not. Mm -mm. <laughs> Mm -mm. It's That's not funny. Fucking, I would like true. to see Welly be Will, Welly Willie. It's Welly true. Be, um, we make fun of it. Submissive. Well, we don't make fun of it. We have just somebody smack the it. shit out of you with a paddle. Nah, my, my mom used to whoop my ass. I ain't anybody hitting me with no paddle. Fuck mm -hmm. that. Uh uh. I do get ass. I do get pictures of guys the their backside with their jeans under their ass. You saw how she said the backside. Yo, the backside with the jeans under their ass with like their. I guess they're plumping up their cake or their ass or whatever. All right, what's the craziest shit in your DM right now? Right now? I don't know. I'd have to go through that. All right, what's the craziest shit in to... your DM that you've seen so far? Just some uh, crazy shit. I don't know. Oh, uh, damn. This is gross. This Not gross. I don't want to say that. It's just a little bit. It's a little bit too much. So let me not say that. Um, I don't know. I gotta. There's a lot. Like, I can't think on the spot right now. Yo, like, why do you think they fucking, that? That's a fucking reality show. Just a whole DM. Yeah, no. If I would have went through with my YouTube, but I, I didn't do that. We can bring. Do we gotta bring Chris Hansen back? <laughs> we could. We could bring him back. It should get. We could do a whole special on that. That's funny. Yeah, you know I mean, like, oh, this is this was Nancy's husband. I didn't even tell him. You know, I could have told him about the time that I was like ten years old and this guy was trying to pretend like he didn't know where to go or whatever. And I turned around, and asked my friend. I was like, Do you know how to get to the bridge? I just moved to that spot. I just moved to that spot. And I didn't know what to tell him. I was like, I don't know how to fucking get to the bridge. So I turn around, I look at her, and I'm like, do you know? She goes, yeah, you got to make this, blah, blah, blah. I turn around, and his dick is out, and he's just groping it, and this slimy yeah, shit is good. out. Yeah, that's what I got. That was the first time I probably actually have remember seeing a dick as a preteen. I swear to God. It's just crazy. Right in front of my house. <laughs> right on my block. Three doors down. Wow. Yeah, we that's... were walking to basketball practice. And that shit was just like me and this girl Dara. Motherfuckers are sick. I don't think Dara wanted that out, but shout out to her. Wow, that's sick. I don't know if it was her Mercedes. <laughs> Damn, you, that's crazy. That's that. some crazy shit. Motherfucker just got his joint out. But <laughs> what type of crazy shit? I mean, that? we were young. We, nothing happened, no, obviously. So not there's nothing you. like that she wouldn't want out. But, but like him, like, they dead ass expose themselves just like that. I I forgot. I completely forgot to say that to him. I was like, like I, I just can't even was think like of neighbor or something. No, I didn't even know him. Never saw him. It was like some kid with a fitted, some white kid with a fitted, and was, oh, I, I don't I was know. Thinking like an old man. Ew, but it was like disgusting to me. Like it was so disgusting. <laughs> like I saw that shit was disgusting. That's, like uh, that, I don't even like to look at that shit in my DMs. I don't want that. That shit, shit is like, crazy. Please don't to me. send me that, please. It's just so crazy to me. Like what do you say? Like oh, I'm about to pull up on these little bitches. <laughs> like I don't understand. He that. must have seen us funny, walk around the it's corner. The, Chris Anson said that's what they say. He must have seen us walk around the corner because we got to go back into my house for something. I don't even remember what. Maybe a basketball. I don't know. This motherfucker had patience. Yeah, because, you know, it's the same car. And she was like, you know, this car's coming this way. Maybe he needs something, but we don't stop for him. He stops first. And then, you know, then I'm like, 20 oh, miles away my from naive, any bridge. My dumb daughter, ass. Bro. Nah. My naive, dumb ass. I'm like, yeah, I want to help you. Like, I, I used to I'm feel like everybody's. Like 
Because you you know you give everyone the benefit of the doubt yeah. until they really fuck up. But now you see how crazy people fucking Not are. Wrong with everybody. And it's like, bro. Now she don't like dick pics. See how that happened? I Boom. don't. I definitely don't like to look at dick pics. I mean, you know, I like other things too. You know. But know he is. said it best. I can't have a daughter, bro. I'm not prepared. Yeah. I would be in the bro. <laughs> if that, if my daughter had a story like that, what he looked like, mm -hmm. and then the second I, I I find out what he looked like, I'm killing everybody that looked like that. No. You know what I mean? No, because killing is no not the way to go. Okay. <laughs> we we got more questions. That's it. No, there's one more question. Do we have time for one more question? One more from Chrissy. Shout out to Chrissy. If Shout a guy, if a guy says he's not in a rush to get into a relationship with you because of past issues he had, is there any chance that you'll end up together? Say it again. I'm sorry. I was if a guy, you. if a guy says he's not in a rush to get into a relationship with you because of past issues he had, is there any chance that you'll end up together? No. Game recognized. Game. He's just trying to fuck. Boom. Are you kidding me? Don't even listen to that response. Game recognized game. See, you don't recognize game. Boom. Yo, yo, fall for that it's dumb not, shit. Oh, it's not. Oh, you have a traumatic past. Yeah, come here. Let me just it's put, not put always the, the case. Like the I had in. mentioned That's before. <laughs> like I mentioned before. A lot of kids were born off putting tips in. Listen, you could be traumatized by some crazy shit. You don't know. Like, what about like domestic violence? Hello? You don't want to get into a relationship with someone because you know that title like changes fucking everything and people might go silent. Psycho. You just to don't know. Not to us. All right. So from a guy's perspective, if I tell her what, if if you're not in a rush, you know, if you tell some, like if she tells you, what about if she tells you that she's not in a rush to get into a relationship with you, but you want to be in a relationship with her, but she can't, like she needs more time. I'm cool with that. That that, that means you're she's... cool with that. Mm -hmm. So boom. So anyway, so you're cool with that. So Welly's answer was out of the question. We got Shadon's answer in there. That was a little bit better. You know what I'm saying? And then mom was, you know, you, you a little realistic to too. Me. You know what I'm saying? Boom. So anyway, she um, to blame me. <laughs> yeah, Chrissy, I feel like, you know, everybody is different in healing. So maybe you just need to give people that time. But they might be, you know, everybody has oh, a different Chrissy cutoff for that. Chrissy, yeah, that's the zone. male friend zone. Mm -hmm. I ain't in the nah, I've been doing a lot of traumatic <laughs> shit, man. No, I just be getting my dick sucked like no, that. No, I, I feel like I feel like that did. title. I feel Netflix like the title of being in right. a relationship or having a boyfriend or girlfriend, whatever. It just changes things. You know, there's more. Um, uh, I don't want to say dedication because you should be dedicated regardless. I guess you know, but. Uh, then again, no, because you know you don't want that stress. You don't want to have to work. You don't want to have to try to worry about someone. Have to worry about someone if. You're not at that state of mind yet where you so, feel like you're that open and you want someone so in there. So is there such thing as being in a relationship but not with the stress? Like, can you be in something cool? Like, that's fun and just... Yeah, but... You on your side of the Is world? that a relationship? It's a different type of relationship. But a relationship girlfriend-boyfriend. That's, that's what she's talking about. You could be in that and... You know, you <clears> no, it comes, with, it comes with all the baggage. I think niggas just want a little head. <laughs> uh, I think they want a little head. He that's always think. thinks that. But, y'all... And this was fun, man. I like the pink. I like the pink sweatshirt, bro. Coming mm -hmm. soon. Coming soon. Still you just said that because I said that. <clears throat> no, I like that shit. That shit fire. I said that as soon as I seen him. I didn't even know he was talking to you. It is lit. Yo, I like the salmon color. Lex, where they can find you out on the gram? In case somebody want to jump in your DMs, where they can find you? I tried to talk and there was water in my mouth. You can find me at Lex Get It L E X X G E T I T underscore oh, on Instagram. Yeah. Uh, you could be her toilet, all that shit. Hit her up. <laughs> what was the price again? You said 200 for two minutes? Two minutes, 200 I didn't say any price. Some shit like that? I don't think I did. Because I know people got stacks, but I don't know <laughs> what they trying to do, so I ain't saying I ain't put it out there. Nah, man. Boom. Cerebral Jesus, Instagram. At Sheesh, S-H, triple E. I never know how to spell that shit. E. No, it's triple E, <laughs> quadruple S, and the H at the end. <laughs> One and H? you don't spell out triple and quadruple. Nah, it's sheesh. Let them try. Let them try. S H E E E S S S S H. Yeah. Yo, this Welly's World Podcast, man. I'm Welly. This, whatever. You know the fuck we are. I'm Lex. Get it. We out of here. Peace.